Alright guys, what's going on? Welcome to another week of TNA Impact Wrestling Universe Mode. Uh, we're in the second week of this feud between Austin Aries and Abyss. Last week, um, Abyss defeated Ethan Carter by a pinfall, as you can see. Um, and Austin Aries attacked Abyss after the match. Uh, and I guess that's where the feud kind of started, really. Um, but anyway, tonight we've got a match which is Austin Aries with EC3. So this time Austin Aries takes on Ethan Carter. So that should be quite interesting, but anyway, uh, we'll sim through these matches and then we'll play through this one. Hopefully you guys will enjoy this episode, I know I will, uh, because this should be a pretty good match. Okay, anyway, so, uh, Chris Sabin, Sanjay Dutt, and Gunner. Uh, Sanjay Dutt pins Chris, uh, Chris, Stein, Chris Sabin, so Sanjay Dutt should get, should get like an extra division championship match, really. Uh, Robbie E, Jesse God is his team eye on again. Uh, Robbie E wins, he defeats Jesse, uh, his tag team teammates, I guess. Uh, Gail Kim versus Brooke Testmarker in the first rivalry match uh, of the night. Gail Kim defeats Brooke Testmarker. We've got another rivalry match, Eric Young versus Samoa Joe. Samoa Joe gets the victory and we have a WWE.com thing. With complete disrespect, Samoa Joe continues attacking Eric Young after that match. So I'm assuming Samoa Joe is becoming a heel there. But anyway, we've got our match now. Austin Aries, my favourite, versus Ethan Carter the third. Let's get this going. Alright. Alright, and here we go. Oh, Abyss has come out to ringside. Okay. There's, there's Abyss taking a seat. <laughs> Jerry Lawless welcome in. Oh my god, Abyss looks huge compared to Jerry. Okay, so Austin Aries is going to be taking on Ethan Carter this time. And, oh my god, Austin Aries. What's this? Oh, damn, Austin Aries taking it to Ethan Carter early on in the match. I love Austin Aries, he is an absolute beast. I, I'm really upset with TNA that they aren't using him for like a, a world championship spot at the moment. Like, I mean, he I know he's an X Division wrestler, but he, he's so, he could so easily be a main event guy. And like, I actually quite like the Bobby Roode and um, uh, Bobby Roode and Austin Aries tag team. Like, I mean, who wouldn't? That was a pretty awesome team, it was hilarious to watch as well. But, um, yeah, no, I think they could have done some, something a bit more with that. Uh, they could definitely do more with Austin Aries than they are at the moment. And, um, yeah, I just think it's a shame. But anyway, um, at TNA news, at least, uh, it's, it's actually uh, official. AJ Styles is no longer a part of TNA. Uh, I don't know if you guys already knew that or whatever, but Austin Aries, uh, AJ Styles is, in fact... Uh, joining Ring of Honor in three weeks time, I believe, or two weeks, I'm not sure. Yeah, so AJ Styles is returning to Ring of Honor. I don't know if you guys watch Ring of Honor, but I do, and I'm really excited for that. I'd, I'd love to see Kevin Steen and, Austin and, and AJ Styles to get it on. But I really would have loved to see a feud between Austin Aries and AJ Styles for once. And I'd have also liked to see, you know, one last AJ Styles, actually no, yeah, one last AJ Styles Christopher Daniels match, even though they've had so many, so many. But I mean, there's, you can never have enough of them, or, of, of those two, because they're just incredible athletes, and they just work so well together in the ring. You know what I mean? Christopher Daniels and AJ Styles. I, I think I'd also like to see AJ Styles. Uh, I'd not necessarily work in the WWE, but I'd love to see him work with uh, CM Punk and Daniel Bryan. Like I know um, he's competed with CM Punk before. I've seen I've seen the match or so. Um, I haven't seen a match with him against Daniel Bryan or Brian Danielson or whatever you want to call him. Uh, but I'm sure he's done that too. Um, but at the moment, uh, Ethan Carr is the uh, reversal expert here. But then Austin Aries also... Oh, a beast with that frog splash. One. Not even a two count. Ethan Carr is doing well here. Oh, God. Oh, God. What's this? Oh, no. Abyss. This is coming out to distract. Oh no! Oh no! You fucking asshole! Oh shit! Oh no! Now, now Ethan Carr is in control, basically. Now he's in control. That's just brilliant. Thank you. Okay, so Abyss is definitely the, like got to be a heel in that situation. And no, Austin is attacked uh, Abyss from behind. I don't know, I'm gonna have to find out who the heel is after this match. I have no idea who it is, but regardless. Right, you get out there. Uh, oh no! Oh no! 
Oh, all crucifix. Abyss. Oh. Damn. Austin Aries taking down Abyss. Oh, shit, no. Reverse power slam. Oh, oh god damn, that is an awesome move. Oh, he's working on me. Okay, okay. Oh, he's sending me into the ring now. Okay. Eh, I get out. <laughs> oh, God. That was bad. There we go. Oh, arm drag. Into. Oh, wow. That was a Mongolian chop. Oh, reversal. Oh, and the drop cell. Oh, that was beautiful. Oh. Oh, he missed the... Oh, damn. That was Japanese arm drag from hell. Oh, God. Crucifix pin. One, two. Ah. Oh. God damn, that was close. Oh, wow. He's got a signature, too. This is really close. Oh, shit. Oh shit, I got out the ring. That's good. <laughs> oh god. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. No, 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 no. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I kicked out. Oh, thank god. Oh no. Oh no. He is destroying me now. What the fuck? Don't you dare think you can beat me off that. You bastard. <laughs> oh, oh, he's in. Oh, he's hurting. Oh, man. Oh, this has got to be it. Brain Buster! <laughs> God. One, two, three. Austin Aries gets the victory. Oh, God. That was good. That was a good match. And here are just some of the highlights. Wow. These matches are quite short though. Like maybe, uh, I don't know. Like you'd think they'd be a bit longer. I mean that one was probably about five, five six minutes <laughs> at best. Hmm. I don't know. I mean, that's not bad for me because I can obviously upload Here's videos for very, like, longer than 15 Austin minutes, but Aries. still, it's good. Austin Aries defeats Ethan that Carter Ethan despite the distraction way. from Abyss. That makes him one. definitely the number one contender. So long, everyone. God, that was good. And Austin Aries celebrating, deserving the victory. What an awesome move that is, the Brain Buster. I love it. It's absolutely awesome. Yeah, look at that. Austin Aries, the victor. <laughs> okay, so we're heading on to um, the first pay-per-view of the year, Genesis, or the Royal Rumble, as they so eloquently put it on this. Um, but uh, next week, we'll, we'll see what happens next week. But right now, we've got Austin Aries and Abyss both going over Ethan Carter third. No, nothing coming up from on WWE.com. Uh, the rivalry just continues, I suppose. Uh, but yeah, we'll see what happens. Oh, uh, oh yeah, of course. Uh, the superstars, Austin Aries. Uh, he's booed, but is Abyss. Abyss is sheer. Okay, that's a bit weird. So Abyss is the face, and Austin Aries is the heel. Okay, so we got next. We've got AJ Styles versus Manic. That should be an awesome match. Oh my goodness. Uh, Velvet Sky and Jillian Hall, Gail Kim and Brooke Tessmacher, another double knockout booking. Eric Young versus Samoa Joe in a submission match. I suppose Samoa Joe would have the advantage there. And Abyss versus Austin Aries, balls count anywhere. Oh my god, that's going to be cool. Abyss and Austin Aries. Alright, well, I'll see you guys for that. Until then though, thank you all for, thank you all for watching. Subscribe for more. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Uh, I'll see you guys next time.